The Israel Airports Authority, or IAA, has announced that it'll impose a ban on aircraft with four engines from operating to or from Israel. The ban will come into force on March 31, 2023, and has been introduced due to environmental, noise and sustainability concerns. Let's look at this significant policy in today's video. With the ban in place, four-engined aircraft will only be able to operate to or from Israel in exceptional circumstances, and special permission will need to be obtained in advance from Tel Aviv Ben Gurion Airport, or TLV. While details of what exceptions will be allowed remain scarce, an emergency landing or government aircraft, such as Air Force One and other presidential transports, would presumably be granted permission. Director General of the Israel Airports Authority Hagai Topolansky confirmed the measure, stating, The increase in passenger and aircraft traffic at Ben Gurion Airport is an environmental challenge. I intend to lead the Airports Authority and Ben Gurion Airport not only in the fields of digitization, but also to lead the environment and sustainability in the world of aviation. Stopping the landing of four engine planes at Ben Gurion Airport is one step and the first step in a broader plan that is currently being formulated. The IAA has already contacted airlines to advise them of the upcoming ban. However, there are currently no scheduled passenger flights into Israel using any quad jets, such as the Airbus A340, Airbus A380 or Boeing 747. In the past, El Al was among the carriers operating four-engined passenger aircraft into Tel Aviv, flying regularly to destinations such as New York and Los Angeles. The airline retired its 747-400s shortly before the pandemic. Delta Airlines also flew into Tel Aviv with its 747-400s before retiring the type in December 2017. Emirates currently operates to Tel Aviv twice daily from Dubai with its Boeing 777s. There were rumors that the service had plans for the Airbus A380, thanks to its stronger-than-expected performance. However, following the announcement from the IAA, Emirates will now have to reconsider. Ben Gurion Airport does currently play host to a number of Boeing 747 cargo operators, including Cal Cargo Airlines, which flies the Boeing 747-400F cargo aircraft between Tel Aviv, Liege and New York. It remains to be seen how airlines and cargo operators will react to the ban. The IAA has stated that the ban on four-engined aircraft is being introduced as a result of environmental, noise and sustainability concerns, but critics have argued that the ban will be ineffective. Aircraft with four engines are not always less environmentally friendly than their twin-engined counterparts. For example, thanks to its large passenger capacity, the Airbus A380 has a lower fuel burn per passenger than many twin-engined aircraft. Having four engines does not necessarily mean that the aircraft is noisier either. Advanced technology means that the engines on modern jets like the A380 can be quieter than those on older twin-engined planes. What do you think of Israel's decision? Is it a step in the right direction to achieving aviation sustainability goals? Or does it overlook some of the efficiencies larger jets can offer? Let us know in the comments. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.